What's up, motherfuckers? Ah! Oh, man. Sorry. I just... I don't know. This fucking sick voice, I can... I can have some fun with it, so I'm gonna... Onto the guest room. Let's go. Let's hope I don't fucking die. I mean, I'm I'm gonna die, but I don't want to die mid-game. My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? Everything. All right. Two seconds. Sorry about that. I was getting a cough drop. Which they they don't seem to be fucking working, but whatever. God damn this place was fucking ransacked. <coughs> ah Fuck. Second of July, eighteen thirty nine. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. I would be too. Oh, that's just a bunch of fucking shit on the ground. That looked like a fucking body for a second. That's seriously what I thought it was. A fucking body. Man, can't I hide in these? No. I thought I could. But I can't. Try to see what I can see. Ah, that was a waste. God damn, they really fuck shit up in here. <sighs> Daniel, what? Still having nightmares, I see. Yes, I can't shake them. They come every night. We'll put a stop to them. You'll see. That sounded... <clears throat> that sounded really fucking rapey. Yeah. Okay, at least I'm not the only one. Hold up. Fucking chair. of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, recovered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? 
I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment uh, or fuck. passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Dun dun dun! That felt really fucking slow. Maybe... Nope. I tried. Fuck. One of these times, I'm gonna fucking light one of those fireplaces and it's actually gonna show me something. Or maybe it won't, whatever. There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something. Or maybe there's... Hey! I threw those all over the fucking place. What the fuck? Why are they back to normal? I don't like that. Alright. Have anything. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, -ha -ha. Yahtzee. The key. Please let it be here. All right, what's this say? Staying completely fucking still. <coughs> oh fuck, I moved. The fuck, dude. Fourth of July, 1839. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them, but somehow I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. 
the ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. Curiouser and curiouser. open all the way. Shit. Um. Okay. I can't pull these ones all the way out, but mm, these ones I can. So there's a key in here somewhere too. menthol flavor in my mouth right now, oh my god. Um, shit. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Do I put these back? Yes. No. Maybe. Maybe. 